My name is Amberly. Uh, I own and run Desert Heart Dairy Goats here in Yuma, Arizona. And uh, for today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to milk your dairy goat. So let's get into it. So this here is Kitty. Kitty is a first freshener, so it did take her a little bit um, to get used to being milked. Let um, me grab my teat wipes. Um, so she's gonna be our goat that we're gonna demonstrate on today. Um, she's pretty good. She doesn't kick or anything. Um, she stands still, so I figured she'd be um, a perfect goat to practice on and show you guys. So with milking your dairy goat, you just wanna make sure that you are super sanitary. You keep everything nice and clean. So I like to pre-wipe them before I milk. One of the key ingredients with ensuring that kitty here on the stand is going to stand still, she needs a treat. So let's give her some grain. All right. You're gonna take your fingers, pinch it, and roll. So the key part is pinching your thumb and your index finger to close the milk and then roll your fingers down. So again, pinch high. Inch high, roll fingers, stay in the bucket. For angle, I like to milk from the back. It just seems easier for me. So again, you're going to pinch high and roll your fingers down. So, pinch high. Now there actually is no wrong way to milk the goat, I guess is the term to say. Um, I like to milk from the back just because of the way that my stand is set up in my milk stand. It just makes it easier. Um, I have in the past, however, milked from the side and it was still just as easy. So it's just honestly what you're comfortable with um, and, your, and your preference for sure. So just to demonstrate with you on another goat, this is Casey. Casey is also a first freshener, so it's her first time in milk. And let me just tell you, the first day that we had to milk her, it was it was a rodeo. Um, she kicked, she screamed, she thought I was killing her. Um, safe to say now we're really good. Um, I don't have to use hobbles anymore, which I'm, I'm glad that we don't because it just makes it easier. Um, but I'm just gonna show you milking a different goat. So you're gonna take your index finger and your thumb, pinch high and roll down, pinch high and roll the rest of your fingers down. That just seems to be the easiest way for me to explain is take your thumb and your index, and as you get better with milking, you'll be able to pick up two hands, no problem. Of course, once your goat, ooh, ooh, once your goat gets used to standing still um, and doesn't put feet in the bucket, you can feel more comfortable milking with two hands as well. In case you move it on me a bit, you just kind of keep going. Try to keep their feet out of the milk pail. Casey, thank you. Of course, the most important part of this whole milking process for this goat is this cookie. So she's on this stand and being so good, not only for the grain, but for this cookie. So, once she's done being milked, 
She knows she's been a good girl, so she gets a cookie. And then we get to go off the steps.